Just how popular could this weekend's blockbuster double feature of musical fantasy, Wicked, <laughs> and the action-packed sequel to Gladiator be? This is about survival! Just ask fans who got a sneak peek. I think I'll try defying gravity. I'm so excited. So I came as a Glinda the Good Gladiator to celebrate both movies. The weekend could be as buzzy as last summer's Barbenheimer, when Barbie and Oppenheimer raked in a combined 246.2 million on opening weekend. But will Glicket cast a similar spell on audiences? Just like last time, fans making it obvious which movie they came to see. Gladiator has even attracted royalty. Here, the cast is greeted by King Charles. This is a big deal after a rather slow post-summer season for movie theaters. Paul Dergarabedian is a box office expert. Do you think that Glicket is going to produce as much revenue for that opening weekend as Barbenheimer? Well, Barbenheimer set the bar pretty high. Glicket is reminiscent of Barbenheimer, but it's very different. There's no question that having that, that marketing one-two punch of these two big movies raises the profile and thus raises both of their box office potential. Wicked, which comes from our sister company, Universal Pictures, already a hit, scoring more than 19 million in previews, while Gladiator 2 made six and a half million. And ahead of opening weekend, 65% of survey respondents told Fandango they were interested in a glicked double feature. I got us tickets. You coming? Everyone will be there. As the two films look to conjure a little box office movie magic. Now, while this is considered the year's most anticipated movie release weekend, our expert notes that you've now got a musical paired with a pretty violent movie, and the crossover may be more limited compared to Barbenheimer, but we'll just have to wait and see how both films fare when box office numbers are released Sunday morning. Guys. I think it's nice, a little something for exactly. everyone. You just have to figure out which order. Yeah. Like, do you, do you want the violence and then, like, the nice or vice versa? <laughs> yeah. I think you go nice and then hardcore. In, in a girl dad house, there's only one. <laughs> there's only one answer. That anybody's interested in right now. Yeah, Thank sure. you, Dana. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.